Hello, my friends. Welcome back to Anna's Mobile Home Life. And if you're new, welcome. In this video, I am going to make a crock pot dish. I will be making turkey sausage, potatoes, and some red bell pepper and onion in the crock pot for dinner today. It is very cold out. It actually feels cold. It's about 47 degrees, but it feels colder in the house than it does outside. So I figured I, I was going to make this yesterday, but as usual, I haven't been feeling well. My sinuses are bad. I have a lot of chest congestion and I just wasn't up to really eating much yesterday, but I want to get this going. So I will show you what I got here and we'll get started. All right. I'll be using the Hillshire Farm. It is the smoked turkey sausage. I'll be using that. I have one red bell pepper. Four potatoes and a red onion. So we're going to get all of this cut up. I'm going to start with the messy part first, which is the red bell pepper. We are going to cut that. I have a garbage bowl here. to get rid of any scraps. Just clean it up a little bit. Get the seeds. So there we go. So we're gonna cut that up. I'm just cutting it in little like bite-sized pieces my knife isn't doing too good today but we'll get through it I'm gonna have to sharpen them I hope you're all doing well today. I hope you had a great weekend. I'm sorry you can't see me. Um, after I cut this pepper, I will see if I can adjust the camera a little better where you could see me also while I'm talking away. So let's finish this pepper quickly. And then I'll try to adjust the camera where you can see my face in here also. Hopefully I can manage. I still struggle with that. Getting the right angles and sometimes it's difficult. All right. Yeah, this knife didn't cut through some of them. All right, so I'm gonna push that aside. I'm gonna see if I could get a better view for you. All right, hopefully that's a little better. My head's a, probably a little chopped up, but if I straighten it up too much, you won't be able to see what I'm doing. So we got the pepper cut. Next, we're gonna cut up the potatoes. Cut them lengthwise. 
This one's pretty big. They're maybe medium size, four of them. So I have them in three. And I'm just going to try to keep them somewhat the same size. So that's about what we got. We'll do the next one, half. There we go. Yeah, I hope you guys all had a great weekend. Mine was quiet. Doing my own thing here by myself, as usual. Not much of a life, but it is what it is, guys. I have to deal with it. So I sell this place and get... You know, by more family. If any of you have made this before, let me know. And what you think of it. I'll show you the way I make it. I have two more potatoes to do. Leaving the skin on. There's very good uh, vitamins in there if you leave the skin on. So I need all I can get. So while I'm cutting this up, I had that showing on Saturday. It was a young couple. I don't know the status of it yet, but maybe I'll hear something this week or the beginning of the week. Um, like I said, she usually lately has been emailing me updates on what's been going on and the status of all the showings, who's responding, who's not. So hopefully I'll get that soon. I might get it later today. We will see. This is the last potato, number four. So right now, that's up in the air. Waiting to hear something. The girl in probate has not been responding. I haven't heard any updates on that, if she responded or not. Hopefully, I'll hear something about that. I just don't get why these people are disappearing. Every one of them. Now we're going to the onion. We're just going to cut that up quick. I'm not that quick at chopping, as you can tell. And I, I try to load up, <clears throat> to upload uh, longer videos. I'm trying. I just can't. If I go over maybe 20, 25 minutes, it doesn't let me upload it. It says I run out of space. I don't know why, but I, I cleaned up everything in my phone. I don't even have pictures in my phone. Every video I upload, I delete. So, I guess it's just a crappy phone. But I can't afford anything better right now. But I would love to do longer videos. I ruined a lot of my content trying to edit it and chop out stuff and just to make it work. 
because they're usually long. All right. So we got the veggies all done. They're all going to stay right here. Now I'm just going to slice up this turkey, smoked turkey sausage. <clears throat> I'm just going to go a little thin. I don't like it too chunky. Plus it goes a long way with the potatoes and everything. Yeah, I'll try to keep you guys updated. If I hear any news... I'll be letting you guys know about the showings or the status of anything. As of now, I don't have much to say about it. Maybe once I get the email from her or hear from my agent, I'll have more info. I don't like, you know, being left in the dark. That's how it feels. <laughs> Also, I hope you guys are enjoying my videos. I know they're short, like I said. I would love to do them longer. I'm working on that somehow. I don't know. I still have to figure that out. But otherwise, is there anything I can do to make it better? I mean, I can do things to an extent. I don't have a car, which I would love to do, like shopping, uh, you know, go, taking you with me shopping, stuff like that. But I can't. I'm just stuck right now. But while I'm on that subject, if there's anything... You want to see um, my watch time is a little bit low, uh, the watch hours on my videos. I mean, I do get people watching. Um, I don't, you know, I get a lot of watches, but not a lot of likes. Uh, if you're, if you do enjoy the videos, if you remember and you want to. I'm not forcing this on anyone. Hit the like button for me to help my channel grow. That helps YouTube. Uh, they will get my videos out there more for people to see. If my videos aren't getting many likes, you know, it pretty much stays where it's at. But if I get a lot of likes on my videos or my shorts, whatever it is, they will expand my content more. It'll reach more people. So if you would, if you want to support my channel, uh, that would be greatly appreciated. And if you're here just watching and you like my content, please consider subscribing to help me out. I just thought I'd get that in there. So now... We got all this cut up. I'm going to turn you guys around over to my crock pot and we will put this together. All right. So we have everything cut up. I'm going to add the potatoes first. It doesn't really matter, but this is the way I do it. It, it, it's going to get mixed up anyway, but I usually put the potatoes in there first. Okay. I apologize. I'm trying to get to the potatoes. 
Limited space, guys. Okay. Next, I'm going to add the peppers. And the onion. Okay. Okay. Now to all those vegetables, I'm going to add the granulated garlic right over the top of everything. And some pepper. We're gonna add the kielbasa or the turkey sausage. Okay. Next, I'm gonna add a cup of water. And of course, my chicken bouillon powder. It's one teaspoon per cup of water. So I'm just gonna add a teaspoon. It needs some liquid in there to help the crock pot work. Now I'm gonna get a spoon. and give it a stir. I'm gonna set it on high. This should only take, uh, hopefully two to three hours. It could be longer. It's mostly until the potatoes are tender and that takes a while. So I'm going to cover that and we will let that cook and maybe I'll come back in between to show you what it's looking like. So I will see you soon. Okay, my friends, it is ready. This is what we've got. Let's feel a potato, perfectly fork tender, perfectly cooked. It took exactly three hours. Not too bad. It's pretty quick. So I'm going to plate some up. Oh, I did add a little paprika and a little garlic salt and mixed it in. So here it is. Looks delicious. We're going to give it a try. I'm going to grab a piece of sausage. and potato there we go it's gonna be hot Mm-hmm.
Guys, it is so, so good. The sausage is so juicy. The potatoes are perfectly, perfectly cooked in that three-hour time. The flavor from the chicken broth in there, the paprika and the garlic salt, perfect. Absolutely delicious. If you have not tried this recipe, I suggest you give it a try. If you like all these ingredients, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're new, please consider subscribing to help out my channel. I hope you all have an amazing day and I will see you soon.